Hey guys, I'm packing up right now to go down and do an overnight challenge again in the shed just like in 2018. This is a follow-up video. It's been over three years since that um, video and I'm going to be doing it tonight. Because it's getting near the end of the time where I can sleep outside when it's getting near 40s and all that it's gonna be cold outside tonight but I'm gonna be it's gonna be the last night I'm gonna go sleep outside this year and it's gonna be super fun you guys are gonna get to see everything the shed has changed quite significantly since that last video I know I've showed it off kind of a little bit um, since then but we're gonna be a, doing a full video torque sort of thing um, I'm just gonna pack up right now and we're gonna get going Alrighty, it's about 10 o'clock. I've already brushed my teeth. Um, something that I didn't have back then was this. It's the Complete Office DVD set. I'm going to be watching it tonight. This is this got me through a lot. I also have this light now that's brighter than the lamp. That is bright. Let me show you it in the dark. See, it's pretty much pitch black in here, but look at when I turn on this light. Look how bright that is all lit incredibly from this one light Alrighty, guys i am all dressed and all packed as you can see in that laundry basket right there so we're gonna head down right now Alrighty, guys we are heading down right now it's kind of crazy to think that this is actually the last time um i'm gonna be sleeping in in this shed um because we'll be selling our house it's kind of crazy to think about but this shed has existed um, my mom pulled up a Facebook post from five years ago of us putting in the door this shed has been built for about five years now and just even looking back at the last video the last overnight challenge video how good um, my camera quality is right now um, how much I've changed since um, 2018 back when that video was filmed and you're also gonna get to see how much my shed has changed since then um you've seen slight little updates here and there but nothing like what i'm going to show you tonight in depth so let's go down let's get all the stuff prepared and i'll show you a grand tour of it all right i have to take that laundry basket full of stuff and set it up in there for tonight um so all you guys are going to get to see that So guys, as you can tell, the lights are on, but I'm going to be just setting up this place fully so you guys know just how it looks like when it's completely set up. Alrighty everyone, everything is all set up. I blew up the air mattress. So let me show you around the new and improved shed as of 2021. So here we start at the door. Here's my bike rack that was in a different video. Um, this is where the whiteboard with the exit sign is. Um, if you look right here, you can see that um, you can tell where there was originally in the last overnight vlogging challenge. This main area, Right here was the size of the room, but we extended it out about four feet uh, in 2019. You can tell the new part versus the old bulls. This used to be on the exterior. That's why it's painted like that. See the walls like where it went from the outside. And if you actually look underneath the air mattress, if you look under there, you can see the caulking sealant where the door originally was. Well, it was there, moved over to there. We got the um, Z logo that was originally on the wall. I showed you that in that last video. Here's my only brand new window in the whole place. All the other ones were used. Here are blinds that were originally in the living room. Here is where the coat rack and all that ended up. It's my pouch from uh, work pouch. There's my old red Subaru Forester plates. The uh, uh, magnetic dartboard. My stereo box from a long time ago. My um, Canon Rebel box thing. 
then my VHS tapes back from back when I had a VHS player down here, a TV that was half player. All my CDs. And here is the bike trailer. Here is the thing out of my car I need to put back. Here's a pile of junk, but this was the stereo that was originally over there on a shelf. That's why the speakers are still there. You can see the shelving brackets are still there, but I had to take it away because I added this, this desk. These painter lights are pretty much in the same place as before. So that's where the stereo is. This TV, this was the square TV that you saw before. It was mounted right over here. This is the shelves that used to be over on a wall that used to be right here before we um, created a new wall out there. That's where all these shelves were when there was a desk in here a long time ago. This is the table that was up in my room a long time ago, as well as this desk when I got a new desk last summer. This is originally my first TV ever that I bought. This is the DVD player that was in my room forever. And this whole setup moved down here last fall after Black Friday because I got that new TV as you saw in the I bought two TVs or whatever video. Here is the coveted setup. What we have here is the microwave and the mini fridge that I brought to school and the spice rack as well that I brought to school. Here, let me show you, show it off a little bit better. Um, it's the exact same orientation that it was when I brought it to the school. And then my friend Kaiser gave me this lamp, which I'm gonna bring back up to the house since I was down here tonight. So it's basically the same setup as I had in school 2019 and 2020 in Mr. Steven's room. That rope light has moved to being screwed in around the ceiling. The windows, you can see where the insert is, where you can put a real, a good window that we never bought. So I hope you like the in-depth tour. I'm just gonna show you exactly how it is normally when I'm not vlogging this experience, how it is when I come down here, just turn on the rope lights and watch some TV. So let's get into it. Look how cool these lights are outlining the ceiling. It creates a real, real vibey place. I mean, guys, look at this amazing lighting. I don't think it shows up on camera how cool this lighting is right now. Spectacular. I wouldn't have it any other way. And I do this pretty much every summer I sleep out here, uh, at least once a week. It's really, really cool. You can hear the office theme song playing in the background underneath these amazing lights. And I just lay down on this bed like this. Good morning, everyone. It is now Sunday and um, just woke up. I'm gonna go up and eat breakfast now and this pretty much concludes the overnight challenge. Just gotta pack up all this stuff now. Thank you guys so much for watching. Yeah, so I'll see you guys later. Peace.